could have been one of my most awkward map lead-ins ever. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well done. Let's let's see what happens here. Our players have already introduced themselves, but I'm going to do it anyway. Down the bottom left part of the map, in the blue, it is Complexity Minigun. And up at the top right part of the map, being deceived by our other caster, it is Quantic Destiny. Yes. It's, uh, Destiny had some choice words for me in between the games there. So, but, uh, yeah. Hold on. Oh, 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 come on. Oh, come on. There we oh, go. come on right. now. Had to, had to, had to laugh at <laughs> so. <laughs> uh, oh, it's map, true. The map All of our is hearts, really. blistering sands. It's a very yeah. small map. We've talked about it before. This is the one I try to mentally block out. Destructible rocks <laughs> that are leading in your main. Destiny letting us know that. <laughs> that four-letter word is ramp, actually. Yes. Close position to your ramp. It is very close from ramp to ramp on this map. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes, yes, he is. Uh, Blow that choke wide open. Yep. So, Steven. looks like the scouting probe has <laughs> gotten there to see that Destiny is indeed not six pooling. That's true. It's actually 15 pooling. We saw uh, Violet on this map actually go for a three hatch build. He yeah, ended he tried, up taking man. some early lings and uh, yep. tried to go through those destructible rocks down at the gold. You know, here's the thing with the gold. The mineral income can kind of weirdly sort of justify you building it by the rocks and not by yeah. the base. So if you're going, you'll you'll get about the same income as you would from three normal bases if you have your hatchery kind of outside the rocks at a gold base on a map like this. Yeah. So you can actually sort Ooh. of do it. It's obviously really dangerous, but that's kind of just breaking it down a bit. And it looks like uh, Destiny deciding to go for double gas off of one base. But, oh, uh, oh boy. Yeah, that's true. Boom! Oh, well, there you go. One. There's one. There's we, one. We've got a long way to go, though. Over under is 12. I still pick the under on your mom jokes. Mm, that's true. Just knowing Steven, that was the the rough approximation was two to three per game. So, all right. Well, we're up to one this game. Yes, that's one true. Total. All right. One total, so, so, taking a look around, as uh, Minigun has his cybernetic <laughs> score coming up now. He's evolving the metagame right in front of us, man. I suppose he is. I'm not sure what it's evolving to, but it is evolving into something. Well, Zerg, it's always evolving into something, but I think this is going to be... Um, I, I, am, I, am I actually trying to predict Destiny 1 base builds? I'm going to do it. Investors? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. No, it's going to be Roach. It's going to be Roachling, and there's the lair. So never mind. All right. Okay. Never mind. Never you mind. Never mind. Players coming up now. It's got about 80% uh, of the way to complete, though, so it'll be a little while before yep. it does finish up. And uh, Destiny's course economy, pretty good off of this one base for now. He wants to switch into high tech. He wants to kill his opponent very, very quickly on. Minigun knows something is afoot. What is he going to do to react, though? He does have a second gateway down yep. and a third one on the way. Ah, okay. So just going to be a standard, possibly three-gate expand for Minigun. I mean, again, it's hard to predict things on this map or in this tournament in general we're just yes. gonna roll it hey there is a roach warrant okay i'm like all right i could see i could see roaches being a thing in this map you That's know true. we'll see if he gets like speed really quick for his roaches or something like that it's it's a possibility it's a possible thing that that is a that is a fact this uh yeah. lord flying around down uh, around the bottom right we'll see if it's actually up That's to battle cruiser down there look at that there it crashed yeah. Did you see that? No. Where Go back to where, where you were looking just a moment ago. I was. Oh, you mean over on the left-hand side? Yeah, ah. look, there it is. Down there. So there is. Yep. Very cool. Don't think we're going to be able to repair that one. And uh, <laughs> Destiny does not like this probe being around. No, I can't blame him. I, I suppose, because it's pretty much seen everything that he's doing. It's actually it's Burrow true. It's, that's it's being researched right now with Roach Speed. Oh, I like that, because you know what? Chad Jones does not have a robo. In fact, he's not going to make a robo. He's actually going to get a Twilight Council, it looks like. Interesting, interesting, interesting. And the thing is, is it's probably going to be Blink because he's not going to, I mean, a Dark Shrine where he knows his opponent already has Lair on right. one base, it's not going to be the wisest thing ever. See, so yeah, I think we're going to see a Blink Stalker build from our Protoss player. And uh, Destiny already has his first few Roaches uh, on the way. Aren't they, they're taking out their own destructible rocks. Yep. There we go. There he is. <laughs> I, now they think you're just going to help them out. I hope so. I, that's that's, that's my nice. plan all along. Let's just change link. He hasn't made a zealot yet, but uh, zealot's just running around. He's the Twilight Council, yeah. importantly. So, As we know, all right. these two players do have the gift of gab. Yes. Never forget. That's, that, is, that is a fact. 
And uh, wow, he is he is powering down his own destructible rocks. Really wants it's to get it's out faster. of the range of the Zelnaga Tower. It's faster, man. If you break your own rocks and then break your opponent's rocks, uh, rocks down, it's actually faster reinforcement from base to base. So That's true. If you're going to do this, this is the way to do it. And he's going to go through the middle here. We'll see how many units this pro picks up on. Yep. Uh, all of all them. All of them. Yes. There they are, all of them. And the answer is all of them. And so here's the thing. Roaches had three range back in the day. So Stalkers could have ah, sat and shot them right. while they broke down the rocks. Now with four range, they can't. Destiny is going to be able to get through these rocks just fine, but he's going to need to be careful about getting force fielded. Right. Robo Bay is on the way. Destiny, I don't think, has he gotten burrowed movement? No, he has not. So all he can do is just kind of burrow. Right. And be intimidating. And that's not bad for the next quite a while because he'll be able to it's burrow, be a little jump while. up, burrow, jump up. So, um, All right, he's going for it. Yes, he is. Going to make his way up. He'll have to burrow yep. some units there pretty quick. And does. Burrow's the one in front. Hasn't lost nice. a roach yet. Starting to recover their health. Of course, it is very, very quick while they're burrowed. Pretty yep. cool uh, bonus of the and roaches there. This is so good because he can sneak a couple roaches up through both times. Ah, but the line of sight blockers, Destiny doesn't know if the whole Pearl Dust army is just sitting right past the grass. Right. Now yeah. he knows. Yep, now he does. And uh, takes out the pylon. That's a lot of roaches. Ooh, supply blocks his opponent as That's well. That's right. It's a lot of roaches coming in for Destiny. And he does have Burrow. The Observer is almost out, though. Is he just going to focus down the Robo? Okay, yeah, I was going to say that'd be a bit bold. All right, he's going to just kite those zealots here, doing a little bit of damage to the Robo, but not much. Yeah, it looks like those roaches oh, that were burrowed have gone down. Yeah, Blink is finished. So Destiny has to move back at the moment. We'll see if he keeps floating up with roaches or if it's going to be... Ah, oh the boy. drones. The drones have come off the line. The full potential of Zerg unleashed on your That's Protosses. Right. It's the full potential of Zerg. <laughs> oh, no. The full potential of Stalkers, though, may be a factor in this game. Yeah. We'll have to see. <laughs> Is that an offensive GG? I don't we'll know. See. <laughs> we'll find out once Stalker goes down and the Run. roaches keep running up to the top. This is a dangerous situation. We oh. have a worker fight. It's like one of the great battles of old. <laughs> nice surround. Oh, God. I don't even know what's going to happen here. So uh, those Drobes stalkers. against roaches. Drones against stalkers. Those, uh, those stalkers actually had to blink away there for a second, trying to make their way out of there. But now they've used their uh, blink. And so it's going to have to wait till a cooldown to be able to use it again. It looks like they can. They have 30, 38 to 30 supply. Oh, more roaches coming in. Yeah. Will it be enough? Both players have pretty much lost all their workers. Yes, they have. That's the observer still it. sitting overhead as well. But he's not uh -oh. actually moved it back. So he could successfully burrow a few of the units if he realizes this. He could, he could, he could. He's Destiny, not. Destiny, though, he's backing the Stalkers into a corner. Will it be enough? 18 to 16 supply right now. 16 to 14, 14 to 14, 14 to 12. Oh, my Destiny, God. Destiny, a little bit ahead here. He's going to be able to start to go after some pylons, potentially. No, he's not. He's actually just going to go after roaches. Yeah, he needs to start burrowing and regening some health there. Burrowing the weaker roaches. Is this actually happening? I don't even know what to say there about is this game. No, I don't think there's any... Where's the uh, observer for detection? It's over here to the right. Okay, yeah, that observer, observer is it. lazy. Yes, it is. And Destiny is burrowing those roaches one after another. Needs to burrow that one. Oh, oh he lost a roach. Yes, oh, he did. No, 10 to 13 oh, supply. lost another one as well. So Minigun takes the lead. Four roaches against four stalkers oh, now. That's right. Roaches are still trying observer's to move there. away. Is he mining? No. <laughs> Not at all. Oh, he's trying to do some mind games. I see what the plan is. Clearly. This is smart. There's actually two observers out. <laughs> They're both both mining, obviously. Oh, no! Oh. And Destiny Bros right underneath the Stalker. So sending one Roach off to the left to try and oh, take out this one get, hit point oh, Stalker. Oh, he gets away. Oh, no. And Minigun has done it. He has won this game. <laughs> or has he? <laughs> Queen, why have you not fought? She's not... Helping it all. <laughs> <laughs> Joke tournament. <laughs>